you're in the carpenter blocks mod and the way that this mod works is it adds a lot of new blocks and a new item to minecraft it adds the carpenter hammer and the carpenter's block and then here are the recipes this recipe does not work as of right now when I'm trying it in creative but the way the carpenter block works or any of the carpenter blocks like the carpenter slope or the stairs which the recipe will be in this there's the stairs, there's a slope I don't think the slope's in the thing either the recipe and then there's carpenter barriers carpenter gates Buttons, levers, <coughs> excuse me, and pressure plates, and carpenter daylight sensors, and then there should be a carpenter's hat. And the way that this works is this is ki kind of like scaffolding, but not really. It's more of a uh, exoskeleton where you can put a different block over. So I can put grass on here, and it will make it a slope, and I'll let you create a lot of new and different things things that you cannot create with anything else because it just uses vanilla minecraft blocks after you install the mod and you have to have forge with this mod too but yeah you can dye stuff with uh, let's, uh dye one of these with uh, the dye that that is in vanilla minecraft you can dye it whatever color you want and do quite a bit. I can make you can add on to the sides of blocks and different things like that. So you can do a lot of things. You can add on the top of the block. So you can do quite a bit of things. And the barriers can be dyed too. And the way that this carpenter tool works, if you shift click it will take out whatever you put into that block until you get it to the default block like that and also if if <laughs> I can't get out if you uh, right click like on this you can change what it looks like along with how these blocks work too so you can make these look different However, you want to get it to look in different ways. Let's see if I can get this back to where. There we go. And uh, let's go up here and I'll show you what I built so far. See, the slant works and it's pretty much just a slope. It makes everything nice and smooth. And also, if you. On the stair blocks, I can put extra little stuff on it. If I want to put ice on the side of it or ice on the front of it. I did it with glowstone so it would be uh, lighted up here. Uh, so you, I did the glowstone on these blocks too and of course if I wanted to I can use the dye and dye in whatever color I want all the way up and what I've done with this house, I just made a quick little house, dyed some of the fencing, and this the base of the fence is white, so it is marble, which is nice. I, I mean quartz, not marble. But I would if I, I you could use snow or whatever block you want. And up here I use lapis, and to get that point, I just. Uh, use the carpenter hammer and if you notice that's one of the blocks and to get this darker color I just dyed it and then right here in front of the door is the carpenter's pressure plate where you can disguise it as whatever you want and if you notice right there that opens and it is the carpenter's hatch and I've smoothed out the walls and part of the ceiling and put some lights in just to get you guys a little bit of a demonstration. I think this is a really cool mod. I 
would love to see what kind of creation people can make with this because I think it adds a lot to Minecraft because of the angles and slopes and everything and just building with it instead of building with stairs that you usually can't get or something like that building with materials that you usually can't make into stairs and different stuff like that and fences and making fences look different ways and just messing around with it and seeing what they can build I'd love to see share, comment, and uh, I'll see you guys later. If you guys need uh, anything from the, uh, there should be a link in the description for the mod, and I'll tell you how to download it. If you guys want me to make an instruction video on how to download it and install it and everything, just uh, let me know. See you guys later.